Hey guys, we're continuing with this worship song. Let's jump right back in. Just making sure I color my track so whenever I come back to this one and do a mixed breakdown that I don't have to worry about coloring everything. I don't even have a set coloring scheme because I hardly ever color everything. That looks like wind, doesn't it? Soundtrack. Go purple. Choir. Can do a darker purple. Cool. Now we're colored. I'm leaving this as default logic blue. Got to have at least one track that's default logic. All right. With my Lord God and King, for my spirit shall soar and be lifted ever higher by your holy wind under my wings. With the storms raging on, I'll be rising far. Okay, so now it's time to add some space to this mix. And for that, I think we can use Logic's handy dandy Space Designer. Where'd my piano go? Oh, my piano's over here now. So, I'm going to send this to. Oh. Call it the room. I'll add oh. space designer. Use this on almost every mix because I can just pick whatever room I want. 
So let's think. What does this sound like? Large spaces, medium spaces. Hmm. Piano and string. Piano warmth. Uh, this is hard. Let's try. Let's try. Piano concert hall. We'll try that one. Also, if it's not working out, I have some of those Brocasti impulse responses that work pretty good too. Don't know why I put it there. And then I always like to EQ the reverbs just to kind of focus the reverb on the mids. I don't want any super highs or super lows funneling through a hall reverb. It just doesn't make any sense. It can add a lot of mud. This usually makes it sound pretty clean and nice. All right, so. My wing. As I cast all my cares upon you I trust you, Lord And I know you won't forsake me You are righteous, you are faithful without the vocals right now because I'm going to use a different reverb on the vocals anyways. And I just want to send a lot of this stuff to the same room to kind of add some glue and gives it that live feel that you know, worship music's always going for. to start with the snare because it usually gets the most reverb or the toms but just snare sending too much of the kick to the room. I normally just send a tiny, tiny bit to kind of just glue it to the rest of the drums a little bit, but yeah, I don't want too much kick going to the reverb. Definitely not the sub kick.
the alarm on my phone started going off. That's always fun. Okay, so not gonna send the bass, but we will send all these other instruments. Thank you. 